Hey everybody, welcome back to Heat My Shorts. I kind of planned on doing a second video either today or tomorrow. I wasn't too sure. Um, I did have a different idea as to what I was going to do for this video, sort of. Um, I got my awesome Grimfrost Viking neck knife in the mail from Thomas yesterday, and I still have some peppers that we grew in our garden that's uh, still good in our fridge there. And we also have another pepper grown by somebody else that I was going to eat with this knife. Well, I'm still going to eat that pepper as well, but um, after looking in our pepper container this evening, I realized that some of our peppers are more... Uh, gone, gone bad, gone worse, gone rotten more than I... not saw... Uh, Gone soft, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, marbles in my mouth there. Gone soft more than I was expecting. Some of them even had fuzz on them, which is a little bit scary to me. Um, they usually get fuzz on the stems and the calyx first, and that's kind of the one of the first signs of them going bad. That and the stems shriveling up as well, and the peppers looking soft. Luckily, these peppers do not appear like they have gone soft yet. Um, I don't think any of these four had uh, fuzz on them either, but I gave them all a quick wash just to be safe. And um, so instead of eating this one pepper that our friend grew this evening, I figure I need to eat some pods to, well, to use them before they go bad, because I kept a few in the fridge. We de dehydrated most of them, but we kept a few in the fridge just for me to munch on. But I honestly haven't eaten a pepper in like two or three weeks. Actually, the last pepper that I ate was that, um, that accidental cross, that scorpion, no, sorry, reaper, reaper chocolate boot lacrosse. That's what I'm calling it, because that's what it looked like to me. But that was the last pepper I ate. So my tolerance is low and I haven't eaten peppers. Um, so I need to eat some tonight. And I'm gonna get pretty lit up because these are all super hot. We have a boot jolokia ghost pepper, uh, a Trinidad scorpion pepper, a Carolina reaper pepper, and a chocolate bootla pepper. So I'm not gonna talk about them too much. I am just going to get into it. Actually, I'm gonna tie my hair back too because it's gonna get warm in here when I start munching these pods. Um, I've learned that actually you may notice that if I'm doing a challenge or munching pods a lot of times I'll tie my hair back just because I get so warm in general that um, I'm uncomfortable if my hair is down and I'm doing a challenge or something like that. So tie it back and avoid a little bit of the discomfort and uh, I gotta show you this thing again. If you didn't see yesterday's video, check that out. That is my new Grim Frost knife from our buddy Thomas. Thank you so much, man. This is honestly so cool. I'm so stoked on this. And uh, that's one of the re another one of the reasons that I had to get some pod munches done before, th before they're gone. Get this, get this knife, some capsaicin on it before this year is over. So without further ado, I'm not gonna show you the insides of them. I'm not gonna talk about the Scoville heat units on them. I am just going to cut them and eat them. Having said that, I'm not exactly sure how to cut this one open. Cut a bit of the nose off there by accident, that's okay. Hope you are all having a, a great day or night, whatever time of the day it happens to be where you are. It's been kind of a an okay day here. It's been pretty, pretty up and down, to be honest with you. Um, just a lot of confusion and uh, discomfort from my back. My back was really bothering me today. And uh, yeah, that really affects my mood. Make sure there's no bad seeds in there. It looks good. Let's eat this pepper. Um, so I don't know what you're calling this, a super hot pod feast. Eat my shorts. That's hot. <laughs> that was the ghost pepper. Whew! <laughs> this got me in the throat really. Really good. Mmm. 
one bad seed in this one. That put me to a, a three or four out of ten. Here's a Trinidad Scorpion Pepper. A little bit in the base of it there. I'm not too worried about it. Oh, I'm up to a 5 out of 10 now, I'd say. I also do have a glass of water here, just so you all know. I have no shame in taking a drink of water during this. This is not a League of Fire challenge. I'm not trying to prove anything here. I'm just eating some peppers and hanging out with all of you. <coughs> oh, <burp. coughs> Ooh, pardon me. What am I doing? <laughs> okay, no delay, I'm doing this. Carolina Reaper, down the hatch. Not sure what that is. Mm hmm. Little fungus gnat bugging us. Of course. <laughs> Actually, there's quite a few of them around. It's gotten really bad with those little stupid flies again. I shouldn't call them stupid. They might be stupid. I don't know. I didn't talk with them. <laughs> okay, I am... Um, I don't know what that was. Psyching myself up for the chocolate bootla. I'll show you this one. It's a good-looking pepper for sure. Good way to stall for 20 seconds or so. I'm at a 6 out of 10 right now, I'd say. It's hard to say. Let's cut this one open. I really do like chocolate bootlaws. I hope there's no bad seeds in this one. I mean, even if there is, I can remove them. And that's not a big deal. Oh my goodness. Oh no. <laughs> Okay, it's not full of placenta like it looks like, but there's a good amount. I'll show it to you. This is the last one. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, this is where the video might get funny. Chocolate boot, boot la pepper. I'm already stuttering. My mouth is salivating so much. Uh, you know what? No, no water. I was gonna drink a uh, have a drink of water. Let's just do this. Chocolate bootla down the hatch. Mm-hmm. I can like instantly feel it washing over my face like the feeling the spice like I can feel it it's like a cold feeling at first almost it's so weird what time is it in there? nine and a half minutes is that where we're at right now hang out for a couple minutes and see how this burn sets in Maybe call this doggy over. Hey Maggie? Maggie! Come here! Come! Maggie, come! Come here! Wanna come say hello? Oh, you got the sneezes? Come here! Oops. Get this one then. <laughs> Excuse me, pardon me. What are you dizzy there? Mm hmm? You still sleepy? 
Come say hello. He has. Oh, what a good girl. Oh, excuse me. I've got the pepper burps now from that. Wow, Maggie, what a good girl. Oh, hugs. Do I get hugs? It's burning all over my mouth. The roof of my mouth is pulsating with pain right now. Um, my throat is ripping hot. My tongue, same thing. My gums are throbbing. Um, everywhere. It's everywhere in my mouth. It's a very complex burn. Wow, Maggie, what a good girl. What a good girl, Maggie. You're such a good dog. Uh -huh. What a good dog. Huh? Would you like your foxy? No. Would you like to have it? No. Yeah. What a good dog. What a good dog. I'm gonna drop it. I'm gonna drop it. <sighs> what a good girl, eh? What a good girl. Oh. <laughs> Cramp up a little bit from crouching down like that for too long. I think I might try turning this lamp off. Um, I don't know. There's no light over on this side. The light is up and back there. I can definitely see the sweat on my face from that. Couldn't lit up from that for sure. Uh, wow. No, I was gonna lick the knife. Maybe not. Maybe I'll just wipe it off. Precious capsaicin oils. So all in all, honestly, I don't know if I got past a six out of 10 on my heat scale there. It has definitely leveled off now. I'm back down to, I don't know, a, a two, yeah, two out of 10, I'd say. The, the roof of my mouth and my tongue are all that's really, there's a dog hair floating around. The roof of my mouth and my tongue are all that's really, you know, burning right now. And it's a mild burn at this point. It's really eased off. I don't know whether that's certain endorphins or not. I suppose it probably is because um, those are hot peppers. Those were all super hot. Some of the hottest peppers in the world, some. Not so much that ghost. Pardon me, salivating a bit there. But, uh, you know, ghosts hover around a million Scoville units. I couldn't tell you what the other ones typically register at. I know I've um, researched it in the past, but I don't have it memorized. Not yet. Give me a few more years of this. Um, that actually brings me, uh, reminds me of something else that I did today. Today I, I made a playlist for the channel of every video that we posted in 2021. So, Keep My Shorts Season 1. It's not finished yet, but we are, I think we're at like 387 videos or something like that. And um, I believe it's either January 4th or January 8th was when I did the first, the first drop of Star, uh, Orange Starburst Tincture. And that's what got me started on this whole YouTube journey. Um, where was I going with that? Oh yeah, so that will be when season two starts. Um, obviously I'll look into that and I'll make sure I get the date right when that day is coming. It's coming in the next month. It's coming in a month or so. That's super exciting. We've been doing this for a year almost already. That's really awesome. I'm so grateful for each and every one of you. Um, I appreciate all of you so much. It doesn't matter if you contribute anything to this channel. You don't have to send me anything. You don't have to comment if you don't feel like it. You don't have to even like the video if you don't feel like it. Of course, you can dislike it if you want to. I know some of you do. I don't know why you continue to dislike it instead of telling me what you dislike about it. But do it or don't do it or just be a fly on the wall. 
Pop in whenever you feel like it. You have no obligation to watch every video. I don't expect anyone anyone to watch every one of the videos. Um, I honestly haven't even seen every one of the videos. I don't watch them all before I, I upload them. I skim them and, uh, and I look for the thumbnail and that's it. Well, sometimes. No, that's not true. Sometimes I watch them. If it's something I'm really stoked on, I will watch it. Or if I think I said something weird, I'll go back and watch it. But I'll still post it unless... Well, I've never, I've never filmed something and then not posted it. Other than my, we'll call them outtakes, that I just delete. I've never, I don't keep my bloopers. Some people have suggested I should keep them and do a, a blooper reel of some sort at the end of the year. Maybe, maybe at the end of our second season we'll consider something like that. I'm still, um, still figuring this out. I'm not good at this. I mean, no, that's, I'm sorry. That's, uh, that's not true. I'm getting good at this. We're getting really good at this. Um, when I created the playlist, I went back and watched the first three or four videos today. Wow. Um, I was so awkward and stuttering and not looking at the camera. When I first started, I actually had to use post-it notes on either side of the lens and I posted note, sorry, post-it noted two eyes. I would draw eyes on the post-it note and stand it up so that I would uh, train myself to look at those eyes as if it was a person. Um, that's how I film these videos. I film these as if I'm talking to a friend who is standing in the room with me and just wants to listen. Um, I wish that you could all talk. Maybe one day we'll get into live streams and things like that and then people can pop in and say things and we can keep a chat going or something, but uh, I'm a slow learner. I like to learn slowly and get things really figured out the way that I want to do them but I am a slow learner and I'm cool with that because the products that I come up with are what I envision unless I give up or just put them on a shelf. <laughs> that happens too. But anyways, this video is coming up on 18 minutes now, actually just over 17 minutes. So I'm gonna wrap it up here. I feel great now. My back isn't bothering me as much as it was for sure. I've actually been really sore today. That's been, been a major bummer for me. <sighs> Fungus gnat. <laughs> so to have that, ease off from these peppers is a truly amazing thing to me. This stuff is my medicine and I couldn't ask for anything more natural than hot peppers packed full of vitamins. So thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Thank you very much Basketball Jones for sending this awesome knife. I'm so stoked that you sent this and that we met and that we chat. We chatted quite a bit actually today and I'm really looking forward to chatting with you more. You seem like a really awesome person and I'm really grateful to have you in this community and in our lives. So I'm gonna wrap this video up here. <clears throat> Pardon me. In this corner you will see our subscribe button. If you click it, you will become a member of this family. I'm saying it like a wrestling announcer or something, I don't know why. In these corners, you will see two playlists with some relevant material, probably some pod munches and pepper plant updates. Sorry, I don't know why I did that. Um, I'm weird. You're probably weird too. That's why we get along. <laughs> Have a great day, everyone. Have a great evening. I love you all. This has been Heat My Shorts with Maggie and Steve. We'll hang out again soon, I promise. Bye-bye.